Hey, what's up? Diego Lopez here for Dapp Productions. Today, I am going to show you how to use Warp Stabilizer in Adobe After Effects CS5. Well, here I have my footage and you can see that it's very sh shaky. And I am going to show you the two methods that you can use. Well, here in my FX and preset, I type Warp Stabilizer and here you have it. Uh, I am going to put it in a new composition and that's it uh, there you go, now you are going to take warp stabilization you are going to apply it on the footage and you have to do you have to wait that it analyze the completely the, the video in this case is very fast because it don't have too much frames well, uh, and this time I I have I am going to tell you that Build Studios and Dark Productions are going to link together to make a new channel, and you can see the same the same content in the two channels. So you you can visit my free channel. I am going to put the the link in the description. Well, it finished. Let's see how it it it, it goes. Well, you can see that that the footage is now stabilized in a smooth motion, but I don't want like that. I want to do it uh, stabilized complete. Well, you can do it in here in the stabilization in the result. You can put it no motion, and it's going to stabilize complete, and it's going. It is not going to move. Did you see the footage is not moving more? And you can see that the results are very awesome. You can see. And here, if you put it again, smooth motion. And here, in here, it has the smoothness. The smoothness. And if you if you put it, uh, I don't know, one, one, let's see, one hundred percent. And you wait to stabilize. You are going to see the the change that it's made on. Um, You can see that the smoothness now is different and it's a little bit uh, slower than the the that if you put it 50%. Well, my name is Diego Lopez, and we are going to see you next time.